Kayla and welcome to my channel. In today's video, things are about to get very real and very raw very fast because I'm going to be showing you guys exactly what is in this little mini backpack of mine right here, okay? Um, so I have accumulated so much junk in here since I got this thing for Christmas. You guys have no idea. My bag really needs cleaned out and I need a clean backpack so I could find things easily and have easy access to everything because right now, like, it takes me five minutes to find like one lip gloss and that's just not okay so we're gonna go through this thing together I literally am gonna be showing you everything that's in there so no secrets here <gasps> I'm kind of nervous like honestly I'm kind of nervous but without further ado we're just going to get started and I hope that you guys will enjoy watching let's begin I think I'm gonna go through the front pocket first so let's unzip this together ready all right the first thing I see oh the first thing I see is some money, some dollar do That was supposed to look cool. Wait, let me try that again. Okay. Some dollar dollar bills. Okay, no, it's just six dollars. But I mean, hey, six bucks is six bucks. You could get some lip balm with that, you know? Or some ice cream, my two favorite things that money can buy. Anyway, so then we have, okay, so I have my Visa card and I have my driver's license that I really can't show. We have, ooh, we have this L'Oreal lip gloss. I'm gonna kind of bring my bag up to my knees so you guys can see what's going on, okay? I'm not keeping you in the dark. Then we have this little baby sparkly clear nail polish. I really don't know why it's in there. Oh, we have some hoop earrings. We have these really tacky pink ones that I actually painted myself with nail polish because my outfit of the day was all pink and I'm like, you know what? I really need some pink hoop earrings. I didn't have any, so I used nail polish and I painted them and they look like, I mean, I tried, right? I tried. So then we have, we have more hoop earrings because I just, I love hoop earrings so very much. Oh, I should probably get a trash can for like the things I want to throw away. I'll do that in just a second. We have a cough drop. Okay, I'm gonna just like, turn this upside down and see what else is in here okay so this is everything that's left we have a cough drop wrapper which can be thrown away we have an old oil blotting sheet ew we have a hair clip which i always need and then we have all this change yes you know what i'm gonna do with this change guys i'm going to put it directly into my cupcake For those of you that didn't know this i have a cupcake in my room where i keep all of my spare change and then once it gets filled to the top i exchange it for like dollar bills so let me show you what i mean and i'm gonna grab a trash can in the process so give me a second ready okay here's the cupcake there boom yeah baby okay we're back in business Okay, excuse me. Let's see, everything else, wait, should I keep this receipt? No, I don't really need to keep that receipt. I don't wanna be reminded of how much money I spend on my hair, so I'm gonna throw that receipt away. So now, um, the front compartment is completely empty. As you can see, I'm not hiding anything from you guys. I just showed you exactly what was in there. So now, I am going to be going into this main compartment and dun dun dun, it's about to get real, okay? Literally, like, my whole life exists in this little pouch right here. You, you don't even understand. Like, oh my gosh. Literally, I have not gone through this stuff since December. That is really, really crazy to think about. So, first, we have this little makeup bag right here. And I'm going to be revealing exactly what is inside. Hopefully, it's not embarrassing. Okay, so we have... Oh, that's disgusting. An oil blotting sheet, which I could actually use right now. I'm gonna throw that away. Anyway, then we have, ew, we have a tissue. We have my pack of oil absorbing sheets. We have, oh, this is my favorite thing ever. Okay, this is my custom lip cest, okay? It's a selfie lip cest, so as you can see, um, there's my face, and it says Kayla in birthday cake ice cream. Um, that is my favorite flavor ever, and I think I just got lipstick on my nose, yeah. Not lipstick, but like, um, as you can see, mine has lipstick on top of it. It's supposed to be a clear lip balm, but mine has lipstick on top because I'm always wearing lipstick, and then I put lip balm on top because, yeah, that's just the way I roll. This is like my favorite thing ever, and if you guys would like to create your own custom lip cest, then make sure you check out my eBay shop. The link will be in the description box below, okay? That way you could get your selfie on a lip balm and pick your favorite flavor, like literally any flavor you want. So we have that. Let's see what else is in here. There's, there's a lot, okay. Two lip products, all right. This says 
Poppy, and it's a moisture lip crayon from Bath & Body Works. So then we have this L'Oreal Matte Liquid Lip Gloss. Um, this is a concealer pot by It Cosmetics. Um, we have this Sephora lip gloss, which I'm going to put on right now. This stuff is so sparkly and fun. Mm -mm -mm. Mm, super duper. So then, moving right along. Mmm, that tastes so clean. We have another L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte Liquid Lipstick. Oh, I said it was a lip gloss. It's a lipstick, apparently, in liquid formation. We have another oil absorbing sheet. Gross. So many lip products. Jeez, I really recommend all of these. Anyway, we have this Too Faced Lip Injection Extreme Lip Gloss. And as you can see, I need to repurchase this. We have this Milani Lip Gloss. And it is in the shade Charming. So it is quite charming if I do say so myself. A piece of gum, more oil blotting sheets. We have some tweezers and look, she's like a little fashionista. And these actually work really well. Shout out to my grandma because my grandma actually got this for me. So grandma, if you're watching this, I love you. Mwah! Please ignore my dogs. They're always barking at absolutely everything and it triggers me to no wit's end. We have this Urban Decay lip liner and it's like my holy grail, favorite thing ever. We have two things left. We have a cherry lip smacker and we also have a penny. Let's see if any of you guys could guess what year this is. I'm gonna guess 1979. That's just my wild guess. Comment your guesses below, I'm gonna look. No, 2002. So anyway, all right, we went through that and now oh, we still have so many other things to go through. I'm honestly like very fearful because again, this is very raw and I'm not going to like not show you guys anything. All right, so then we have this pink warm and cozy fragrance mist and this is honestly like the best scent from pink ever. We have a little purple hairbrush. This is actually a mini wet brush. Moving right along, let's reach in again. We have this Maybelline Fit Me Matte Plus Poreless Pressed Powder in the shade 120 Classic Ivory. This is one of my favorite drugstore pressed powders ever. Actually, I take that back. It is my favorite drugstore pressed powder, okay? Um, you can't beat it. I love it. Then we have some earbuds. Oh, we have two Target gift cards that I am very eager to spend. We have a Sam's Club gift card. Then we have this piece of paper right here. And oh, it's literally just my work schedule. That is old, I can throw that away. Um, and it was taking up a lot of room. So <gasps> this is the most fabulous thing ever, guys. It is a pink pen and it has feathers on top. Like, oh my gosh, it's a pink feathery pen. When I write with this, it just, it gives me life. I love anything pink, as you guys know. And guess where I found this? At the Dollar Tree. We have some deodorant. This is Lady Speed Stick Invisible Dry Power. Honestly, like, it smells good, but it really just doesn't cut it most days. It just doesn't, I'll be honest with you. I got this at the Dollar Tree too, cause I like to see like what things I can get away with buying at the Dollar Tree. It's just like not the best, but it's okay. You know, it works for like a little while. Anyway, let's see what else is in here. Oh, so we have my little wallet right here and I have my little CPR certification card. I have like a million gift cards and my library card. It's not worth going through, nothing too exciting. Then we have my favorite pair of sunglasses ever, okay? Hey, you could see my studio lights. You could see my ring light in the reflection of my glasses. I literally got these, I think for free at Air Apostle. Don't ask me how I got them for free. They were having some deal one day. Anyways, then moving right along, we have some extra peppermint gum because I'm extra Duh. Okay, sorry. I just had to. But um, yeah, that's, that's some pretty good gum and my hair is getting stuck in my lip gloss. All right. We have this nail file and it says pretty little dancer. So it's always good to have. The next product to make an appearance in this video is this feminine product right here. <laughs> Enough said. <laughs> we have a mirror. Ooh, baby. Look at how fancy schmancy this is. Can you guys see yourselves? Wait, no, you can't. Ah, you kind of can. No, just kidding, you can't. But I mean, how cool is this? I don't even remember where I got it, to be honest. But look, it's like this little pink 
crystal diamond thing and then you just go boop and boop and it's oh i just love it it's very handy dandy handy dandy notebook okay comment below if you know what that's from so then we have oh my favorite pen of all i have a lot of favorite pens but this is one of my favorite pens it is my literally lip obsessed pen um if you guys don't know i have my own lip balm brand called lip obsessed and um i got this pen customized just for moi that says literally lip obsessed because who isn't literally lip obsessed i mean come on then i have guys a little bit of background story behind this right here this this is not just red lipstick okay this is not just a tube of cheap wet and wild lipstick okay this actually has been in my life since i was 12 years old i got this baby in grade seven yeah that means that it's eight years old. Can you even believe it? I can't. Um, and the sad thing is, I wore this like every day and I thought it looked really, really good. Like I, I really put it on too, probably very unevenly. And one day my mom actually hid it from me because I must have looked that atrocious. So thanks mom. But I don't even know why it's in here. I probably wore red one day and I put it on just for the occasion. We have, oh, another one of my favorite pens and it's pink, what do you know? Um, this one, actually one of you guys gave it to me. One of my subscribers sent this to my PO box. Um, it is the coolest pen ever because look, it's, wait, you can't really tell, but here, I'll doodle on the back of my hand so you can see. It's pink ink and it erases. Then we have this Too Faced Melted Matte Liquid Long Wear Lipstick in the color Sellouts. I honestly forgot that I had this. Okay, oh, we're getting to the good stuff now, guys. Are you ready? So, I mean, we have a couple more makeup products first, but then gonna get juicy just kidding not really but we have this Maybelline line stiletto liquid liner we have my dirty little secret lip gloss which smells like pistachio pudding I literally want to eat it like I'm actually gonna put a little on my tongue mm. it doesn't even taste bad we have my Tarte shape tape concealer oh my gosh the inside of this bag is so dirty it looks like I'm a kindergartner that had a box of crayons in here and look like how does this happen? I just don't get it. We have, oh, these will come in handy. We have two packets of sugar, in case I need it, in case I'm desperate. Two hair clips. Um, oh, this is sad. This um, this broke off my keychain. It was a little pair of lips and it was so cute. And I'm gonna see if I could reattach it because I loved it so much. And then last, but certainly not least, okay. I really want to see if anyone can guess the very last thing that I'm about to show you in my purse, okay? Um, I feel like some of you guys might be able to guess this because literally this thing I'm about to show you is in all of my what's in my purse videos or purse declutter videos. So what's the one thing I haven't showed you guys yet? Comment below if you think you know. Hopefully you paused the video and commented. Anyway, I'm going to show you right now. Salt! Duh! One of them is empty though. But salt, okay? Um, I'm a saltaholic. That sounded weird. It sounded like I said, I'm a saltaholic. <laughs> no, I'm a saltaholic and I always have to have some salt. I actually only have two packets this time, so that's pretty good. Um, but yeah, as you can see, that was literally everything. Look, yeah, we went through all of it. We decluttered the whole thing, the whole shebang, okay? I hope that you guys found this video entertaining. I actually was pretty entertained myself going through everything and seeing just what exactly I had in there. If you guys like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And I would love it if you would leave a comment below and let me know what is one necessity that is in your purse or bag or handbag or mini backpack or large backpack or whatever you know just let me know what your number one necessity is i don't know i'm gonna go with my visa that is my main necessity and then also oh girl my oil absorbing sheets that's another one actually let's pick three of our necessities my three are okay oil absorbing sheets um money or visa card and all right i'm gonna go with my sunglasses okay but yeah, guys, if you have not already subscribed, make sure you do that and turn on post notifications so that you never miss another awesome video like this one from me. But I love you guys to the moon and back, and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye! Mwah. Yeah!
and that's a wrap. A wrap from me. They are literally always interrupting me. Cannot even.